and it's quite it's quite all of the buildings. Welcome back, everybody. Obviously, we're in Birigara because you've got the fire burning because it's winter here. <laughs> and Abby's over there and she wants to go out and play with all the animals. So we need to clarify because I know we confuse ourselves, so it's not a surprise that we confuse you. To date, we visited in a total, when we're in Europe, a total of 12 chateaus, and to date we've shown you five. So we've still got another seven to show you, and it's one of those 12 that we made an offer on. That's correct. And, and <laughs> we made an offer. They signed the do we signed the paperwork. They signed the paperwork. We got it back. We celebrated. And then the next stage was last Friday, we had a Zoom with the notaire, the real estate agent, and another person. They informed us that because it's got land, that it has to be approved by SAFAR. So in order to do that, they, Safar, need to list it, they need to advertise it, and wait two weeks. So although we've had it signed by the owner, signed by the real estate, and signed by us, unconditional from our point of view, um, we have to wait to see if Safar want to sell us the property. <clears throat> from being super happy about what we've done, we actually now started shivering and shaking and we started, um, yeah, potentially freaking out about the what ifs and when will we know if it's ours or not. And we want to show you the other, the next shadows that we've been visiting and you can never guess if one of those would be it. But yeah. So we'll make your own decision on it. Yeah. So we got incredibly excited and we're still excited and we're very optimistic and the notaire pointed out that he was fairly confident mm. um which is sort of good and bad it sort of means that no one else was prepared to buy it i guess uh but if that's the case we'll be happy anyway so uh, we just have to wait another seven days this time next week if you're wondering what safar is because i didn't really explain it it's a government organization which is designed to protect the farmers to ensure the rural land is all used for its proper purpose and isn't just wasted. So they're the ones who've got to say yay or nay. Um, I want to do a little shout out to Denise from New Zealand because Denise is one of our um, followers and she has been watching us for a while and picked up that I'm actually running a day spa. Fair enough. She contacted us and contacted me a few days ago and she's sending out her daughter and her um, partner to the farm and thank you for that. And who knows, she may even visit us when we're living in France and got a day spa there. Yes. <laughs> That's the hope. Um, also, I want to say to Chris and Shay of Torquay, Chris has been supporting me in finding different chateaus and sending me information because I know he's really interested in it as well. And it's amazing the amount of work people put in. So uh, thanks, uh, thanks to you guys. Thank you.
Milk has to kiss. It's right here, isn't it? It's nice the sun is coming. Mm. So after a busy day, we uh, decided to go out for dinner. The two properties we looked at today, one was 1.8, the other was 2.1. The one for 2.1 had big power lines in the background, so that one was ruled out. You wanna wonder if these properties are worth the money they're asking. So in this Zoom call, I actually asked them how... Sama. <laughs> you said so in the Zoom call. You said it started with Sarah. Have you? Can I start? Yeah. Not all of that. Yeah, the whole thing. What do you think? Excuse me? It's good, isn't it? We might need some bits and pieces. Oh my heavens, isn't that fabulous?